Hello everyone, I'm Kirsten and here's what's up. This week's webisode is sponsored by the Masters Arts Festival and it's a two day festival over on Palm Avenue with over 70 artists and all different types of medium and art with sculptures, jewelry, blown glass, all these amazing things that are on display and also for sale. So go check out the Masters Arts Festival two day event this weekend. Over at the Sarasota Museum of Art, Lisa Hoke has been in town for a couple weeks now and she's working on an exhibit on the first floor and you can watch her work as she does this. And the reason that's so exciting is because she's got piles of trash which is going to be turned into beautiful works of art and it's amazing. It's all these bright, wonderful colors. She's just great. So trust me, you're going to want to go check out Lisa Hoke at the Sarasota Museum of Art. And if that's dueling banjos you hear in the background, you might be correct. Ronnie Cox will be in town and he's famous for movies like Deliverance, but he's also a musician now and we're lucky enough to have him over at WSLR's Fogartyville this Friday night. At the White Buffalo Saturday night, Adrian Ray will be in town and when I googled him, I had to think, is anybody hearing my thoughts right now? This man is beautiful and he's also talented and a great entertainer. So go check him out at the White Buffalo this Saturday. You will not regret it. And Sunday is the Super Bowl. And that's all I have to say about that. And once a month at the Ringling, they do yoga at the Katazan on the terrace. And this Thursday is that once a month. And they've added something new and interesting to it. They're going to have live local bands performing. So it's 8 a.m. on the terrace at the Ringling. So that's what's up with me, Sarasota. Tell me what's up with you. Feel free to leave a comment. And for more information on any of these things I mentioned, click the links below. And as I always tell you, I hope to see you out there. And I have. So I want to see you some more because I love you, Sarasota.